Hey y'all, thanks for tuning in to the official TDS recruitment video. I want to start by telling you guys a little bit about ourselves. We are an established esports org in the state of California, started by three owners whose envision was to become the biggest, best esports family out there. My first personal challenge to y'all is to reach out to our socials, our Discord, to find out what we're all about. That's going to be your best way to get to know us in this family. My second challenge to y'all is to please watch the whole video, like it, comment on it, share the video to friends, family, get the video to as many people as you can. Because the structure around this team is built around you guys, the people. And the more people we can get this video out to, the bigger this family can be. In this video, you guys will meet some of the members that have helped TDS become the org it is today. They will tell you our goals as a team, what we expect out of our comp players, our CCs, our VFX, our GFX, and most importantly, how to apply to be part of this family. Just remember, I appreciate y'all, I love y'all, and I hope y'all enjoy the video. And I'm here to talk to you today about professionalism, sportsmanship, and what we expect as owners of the team and as communities of this team. Um, some of the things that have taken place in esports aren't tolerated on our team. It's pretty simple. There's no exceptions. There's no, oh, I didn't mean to do it. Um, and we're gonna talk about some of those. We're trying to create an environment where people feel safe, where people can find help for whatever they're dealing with in their life, especially nowadays, where they're not judged for who they are and where they feel the love of the community. If you fit that model, great, wonderful. If that model is not for you, great, have a good time. You, at all times, represent TDS. So what you do, and when we look at past streams, what you've done, what your behavior is, and in considering you for current membership, it all plays a part. We are the sum total of everything we've done in our experiences. I want to talk to you guys about what we're looking for in content creators. So when it comes to content creators, there's a few different things. You don't have to be a streamer to be a content creator. Content creators, just like it sounds, we want people who create content. Um, now what we look for when it comes to that is two things. We look for quality and consistency. So if you are a streamer, we want you to stream consistently. It doesn't have to be a ton, but you know, if you can stream consistently a few times a week, awesome. Um, it helps out with not only the team's growth, but your own personal growth, which matters to us. Um, and if you are going to be someone who creates content outside of streaming, like YouTube, um, Instagram videos, TikToks, whatever you do, um, we want it to be, once again, consistent. What's up, guys? My name is Blaze, and I'm the Fortnite comp lead for TDS. I'm looking for competitive players who have had an interest in comps since at least FNCS trios. The players I pick up will need to have a want. For constant improvement, I specialize in VOD reviewing and the mental aspect of the game. You have to meet my requirements in a practice regiment that is to my guidance. This includes scrims, mechanics, and VOD reviewing. I work with my players to make sure they are constantly improving. Yeah, ninjas in the background. Anyway, I'm the lead designer of TDS, talking to you guys what it takes to join uh, TDS as a designer. We're looking for people who can be creative and express something in their designs. Um, we're looking to pick up people who do social stuff like banners, headers, profile pictures, logos. And we're also looking for people who make 3D modeling, uh, such as Fortnite thumbnails. And yeah, that's about it. Um, just be creative and express yourself in your designs. And yeah, thank you. What we are looking for in terms of Fortnite editors are people that are familiar with the replay system in Fortnite and don't use pre-recorded cinematics. You should also know how to add special effects to the video, like screen pumps, transitions, color corrections, and so on. In terms of IRL editors, you should be creative with your skills and try to think outside the box. Be able to add nice background music cuts and clean transitions. So here we see the fear.tds Instagram page. This is our Team Damage Souls Instagram page. If you make your way to the link in the bio, and this link will also be in our Twitter bio and other socials, click on that. This link tree it has all of our different social medias attached as well as the TDS recruitment form. 
When you click on the recruitment form, it should bring you to a Google fo uh, form. And this Google form outlines all the different things you have to fill out to apply to be a part of Team Damage Souls. Now for all applicants, whether you're competitive, GFX, VFX, content creation, please link one page or video or portfolio or whatever it may be in this part of the form. This is your highlights link and this will be uh, pretty much the thing that we look at first when we're looking at your application as well as the other stuff that you mentioned. Hey, thank you all for watching. I appreciate you all. I love you all and I can't wait to see what you guys bring. So my third and final challenge for all you guys is please be patient. Please don't be discouraged by whatever happens um, and keep on loving. And remember, we're always expanding. We're always growing. Thank you guys very much. I appreciate you all.